Hi guys, it's GameGot10 here again, and we're gonna do another episode about BB guns. And I had an accident today on my knee. Ow! That didn't hurt that much, but anyway. Yes, that was the mag of the gun that I had in my last BB gun episode. Jesus, my knee hurts like a duck. <sighs> I hate, literally, I hate you. It's like a mess. Alright, so. This is the BB gun I showed you in the last episode, and. Very powerful. Uh, yeah, as I said, I don't got shot there, I don't got shot here, and on the toe. Yeah, so. Uh, as I told you, like the barrel and everything about this gun. Uh, yeah, so. This episode, you'll see me fire this gun. But that's one thing you get to see. Me firing a gun? You'll be thinking, hey, he can't shoot a gun. But this thing can be fired. Very. It's not hard. It's like, like, say it's uh, about, it's about, say, it's like, in, in my perspective, it's like, In a matter of fact, I'm actually going to use like either one of these. I'm going to use one of them and on these three: Diamond Steve, Zombie, and the Villager. So, and this is the box I'll be using. The connect box, yes. I know you're thinking, is there a real connect in there? Nope, there is not. There is actually, I have my connect over there. And in some of my videos, you can actually see the connect. So, I'm gonna just do it like. I'm gonna show you the setup how I set it up. It's actually quite hard to set these up because they're hard standing. Uh, Alright, so don't listen to the adverts because obviously it's for God's sake. Cheers! Right, so I'm going to use C3PPO, whatever his name is, C3PPO. I can't, I say it like that. Right, and so, this time, this is what it looks like, for the setup of the uh, characters, I'm going to try and like make it like look like that, or a certain degree or an angle that you could see it, but I just like to... Oh, that's my knee. My bad knee. Oh. I have to limp sometimes, but not all the time. Oh, right. One of my villag right. villagers fell over. The Lego person seems to stand up more, so I'm going to just use the Lego person. And we're going to show you how good my accuracy is. 
something that is powered and it's kind of good really and wait how loud does this tally have to be? it has to be loud doesn't it? well I just turned on my telly so I haven't loaded my mag yet but I'm just gonna find the rounds oh I have to limp everywhere which is actually slower than I thought um, so what I'm gonna do is just load it for say about the full mag I'm just gonna put it on the full mag yeah so always have this on a parental advice because never fire these things these things can actually hurt keep them away from younger three year olds and they're about two or one. Anyone under the age of six or seven, because that's just to tell them that if they fired at themselves, it would really hurt. I've got fired out a couple of times, but yeah. So as you can see, the C3 PPO um, on that box. Um, I'll end up making a mess, but. Oh crap, right, the, the gun is now not jammed, right, so I'm going to have to use the opposite knee, which is actually quite hard, because I normally use my other knee, and, yeah. Right, so, as I said, this is the, the, the orange gun for my last episode, and this is me firing at that mini target, as you maybe can't see, six minutes or five, I don't know. Check the camera. Alright, go! Alright, so it's, it is hard to fire these things. Well, because I have I haven't got good accuracy. I've got like. Whoa! Right. From the third shot. Here we go. Alright, so. Alright, so you can see my gun is quite close to the camera, and this is my a a a h six seventy camera, and this is actually quite good. This is hard to fire at because he's actually such a small target, and I don't think I have any more rounds. But that's me, good firing. If it's a bigger target, I'll just... You better clearly I'll tell you. Okay, right, so there's another one there. Right, so... So, these are the bullets again. And they're very small, so... keep, As I said, keep them away from... Uh, 9 to... No, from 6 to... 6 to... No... One to five year old, no, one to six year olds, or seven, because these are very hard. And well, if you if they get shot in the face, uh, it's not my fault. Shouldn't aim the gun at their face, so I uh, use their initiative. And yeah, so hope you guys like this. Uh, okay, I'll just put them in my camera. Hope you guys like this episode. Smash the like button, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye.